We're now in section three of your AutoCAD Electrical 2015 course. And as per the previous videos about your working files, you can see in the project manager, we have the project demo 03 for the third section of your course. And we've currently got the drawing demo 01.dwg open. You can see the tab there. And when I hover over the tab, I can look at the model tab in the drawing or the layout tab in the drawing. And you'll notice there I can also plot and publish if I need to. Now what we're going to look at is the quick access toolbar in this video and you'll find that top left of your AutoCAD electrical screen, these icons here. So you can see we've got some basic ones like new, open, save, undo, redo. I can also plot quickly. I can also go to my project manager there and that will open or create a project of one or more drawings and reconfigure any project wide settings as it says in the flyout menu there. So you can use a non-AutoCAD electrical DWG and create a project or configure project settings from it. You can also toggle between the project drawings on the quick access toolbar, previous project drawing and next project drawing. As I've stated previously, AutoCAD electrical runs with a database behind the drawings itself. That is the project, the AutoCAD electrical project. And you can surf to related references of an item that you select. So if you click on the surfer in the quick access toolbar and select a component on one of your AutoCAD electrical drawings, you can surf to all other related components throughout the entire AutoCAD electrical project. Clicking here on the little flyout allows you to customize your quick access toolbar. So you can see here new, open, save, undo, redo and plot are all ticked and they are already displayed on the quick access toolbar. If I wanted something like save as, I click on it and it adds the save as icon now to the quick access toolbar. If I click on the flyer again, click on save as again, that unticks it and removes it from the quick access toolbar. Now there were some other commands just down at the bottom here. So what I can do is I can go and look for more commands to add to the quick access toolbar. I can show the menu bar and I can also show above or below the ribbon. Personally, I prefer my quick access toolbar above the ribbon like so. So I'm going to leave it there. But what's this menu bar that it talks about? If you've used older versions of AutoCAD, you'll understand. I'm just going to click on show menu bar and there's the menu bar at the top of the screen. So if I click on edit, can you see I get the old pull down menus like you used to get on older versions of AutoCAD and all the sub menus kick in as well like that. So XREF and block in place editing. It's all the old flyout menus that you used to have on the older classic version. I'm just going to hit escape there to remove those menus. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to click here and customize, and I'm now going to hide the menu bar. If you're using the ribbon, you don't really need that menu bar. But if you're using the old classic version of AutoCAD, which you might still do in AutoCAD Electrical 2015, it depends on what you're used to and what you're comfortable with, you might want that menu bar showing on the drawing itself. That's the quick access toolbar. You'll find it in the top left corner of your AutoCAD electrical screen.